Hey YouTube, what's up? It's me, the boss Ella, coming to y'all. Um, I wanted to do a, a video about Mimi, cause I've had Mimi for a while now, cause I had to rock uh, different styles, cause I'm going through this this natural journey. I haven't had a perm for one year, and uh, yeah, one year. So anyway, I wanted to show y'all Mimi. This is uh this is um Connie by Solstress, by the way, if anybody's interested. I don't like it. I bought it. I really don't like it. But hey, I got it now, so I can work with it. So um let me uh let me show y'all Mimi. So y'all know I'm country, so I'll just take the wig off right now. Hey, how y'all doing? It's me. How you doing? So like Wendy. Okay, so I got my Mimi. Mimi looks like a uh, roadkill. This is Mimi before you do anything to Mimi. Hey, what's up? <laughs> this is funny. I look like Era. Uh, Could you Era? Uh, anyway. Anyway, y'all. Y'all know I just used the water on Mimi. Straight water. So this is Mimi after she's been sitting, kind of hugged out, kind of looking like a roadkill or something but uh let's style Mimi right quick and see if she's still rocking it out we can still rock the Mimi y'all know to get her all saturated I already had on my stocking cap and a little another wig on today but I was like let me go and do some wig videos while I'm sitting here. The best way for me to get Mimi controlled really quick is to use a brush. See that? She just waves up and lays down like she's supposed to. She's looking pretty already. Y'all see this? I didn't I don't think I cut these, but what I do is I just put part of them behind my ear. And this is a lace front wig, but when I put that behind my ear because it doesn't have any combs in it. And I think they come with combs now. I think I got in on Mimi back in the day. But um when I don't put the combs in it, I mean it doesn't have any combs in it, so I put that behind my ear and it kinda adds a little um uh, kind of helps it stay on a little bit just a little bit and y'all know Mimi has a part in it but when you use a brush you can put the part anywhere you want to put the part so this is Mimi and she's still she's still hanging in there I really want to put some combs in her I think I will because I like for the back of the wig and the front of the wig to be really snug and uh, I don't like to do that with those adjustable straps because it gets too, too tight on my head. I like maybe kind of curly in the top. I did a concert the other day. And I was on with George Huff and... Cuba Gooding Senior and the main ingredient and I wore the Mimi I rocked the, the Mimi for a performance and she rocked out y'all she was rocked out when I get the footage for that I'll be sure to post that alright well this is Mimi really quick really fast like I said I have a ponytail back here y'all so if my head is looking like super long it's cause that's my hair but this is Mimi in the back She's still, still holding on. That's my girl. Look at that. Just, 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 just style her. And she'll act right. She'll act right for you, you know. Mimi. Mimi is holding on. I like Mimi, y'all. If you just want to be real special, you could kick a flower into Mimi. You know, just, just kick it up there like, bam. Oh, mmm. E or not. Ouch. You don't have to put the flower in there, but 
Mimi is a real nice addition to my family of wigs. They love their sister. This is one of their sisters. And uh, she's a good addition to the family. So this is Mimi. She's still rocking, y'all. So get the Mimi, the mommy. I don't know. Get one of them because they, they're really cute. But so Mimi, still rocking. That's it. Love y'all. Peace. Bye.